Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to transform the given equation zxx plus 2zxy plus zyy equal to 0 by changing independent variables using u is equal to x minus y and b is equal to x plus y. Now as a first part, we are going to find zx which is nothing but dou z by dou x which is dou z by dou u into dou u by dou x plus dou z by dou v into dou v by dou x. Now dou z by dou u let us write as it is then dou u by dou x is 1 plus dou z by dou v we write as it is and partial differential of v with respect to x is also 1. So finally we got dou z by dou u plus dou z by dou v which is dou z by dou x. Now we are going to find zxx which is nothing but dou z actually dou square z by dou x square which is once again nothing but dou by dou x of dou z by dou x. So here we have two terms both are dou by dou x but one is without z another is with z. Then without z we have to write the term without the z term. So for the first part it will be dou by dou u plus dou by dou v into with z it is dou z by dou u plus dou z by dou v. Now let us expand this. When I multiply first term with first term we get dou square z by dou u square. Then first term with last term dou square z by dou u dou v then dou square z by dou v dou u then dou square z by dou v square. So we got z x x but this can be further rewritten as z x x is this is z u u and this one is z u v plus z v u and this is z v v. So we got the first term. Now we have z x y. So for finding z x y first we have to find what is z y which is dou z by dou y which is once again dou z by dou u into dou u by dou y plus dou z by dou v into dou v by dou y. Now dou z by dou u let us write as it is u with respect to y will be minus 1. So this is minus so I will keep the minus here. Then this is dou z by dou v into dou v by dou y possible differentiation of v with respect to y is 1. So this will become 1. Now let us interchange this because there is a minus sign in the first term. So let us write that as a second term. So we got dou z by dou y. Now we need z x y two times. The two we can include later. So z x y is nothing but dou square z by dou x dou y. So this can be written as dou by dou x of dou z by dou y. So we have two terms dou by dou x and dou by dou y but with respect to x does not have z but with respect to y have z. So for the first term dou by dou x we can take it from here. This is our dou by dou x without z we have to write dou by dou u plus dou by dou v. So this is dou by dou u plus dou by dou v. Then for the second term with respect to y 
that we have it here, which is dou z by dou v minus dou z by dou u. Now we are going to expand. We will get four terms. That is, first term is dou square z by dou u dou v, then minus dou square z by dou u square, then plus dou square z by dou v, actually dou v square. So we can write together as dou v square. Last term minus dou square z by dou u dou v dou u dou v dou u. Since in the term we had two times of z x y, we will also put two times of this whole term. So two into this entire term. Then third part we need z y y. For that we have to find what is z y first. Z y already we have found it. That is minus dou z by dou u plus dou z by dou v. So we will write dou z by dou v first. Dou z by dou v minus dou z by dou u. And we need z y y which is nothing but dou square z by dou y square which is nothing but dou by dou y of dou z by dou y. So once again here both are dou by dou y but one is without z and another, another is with z. So for without z we have to copy from here without z that is dou by dou v minus dou by dou u into now with z that is dou z by dou v minus dou z by dou u. Now we have to expand this and before that this expression can be rewritten as 2 into the first term will be this is z u v then when I multiply this 2 here minus 2 into z u u then plus 2 into z v v minus 2 into z v u so already we found this expression let's keep this as 1 and this as 2 now we are working out the third expression which when we multiply we get dou square z by dou v square then minus dou square z by dou v dou u then minus dou square z by dou u dou v and plus dou square z by dou u square and this can be written as z v v minus z v u minus z u v plus z u u and this is our third expression. By adding all these three we will get this equation equal to zero. So let's write that so now we have zxx plus 2zxy plus zyy equal to 0. So we have just copied the entire equation. Now for each part I have to substitute. So for zxx from the first equation zuu, zuv, zvu plus zdv. So I will substitute here zuu plus z u v plus z v u plus z v v then 2 into z x y from the second expression 2 into z u v so plus 2 into z u v then minus 2 into z u u minus 2 into z u u then plus 2 z v v plus 2 z v v then minus 2 z v u minus 2 z v u 
then from the third expression the third term z y y is z v v minus z v u minus z u v plus z u u equal to 0 so from this we have z u u and this is another z u u this is minus 2 z u u so all the term will get cancelled in the same way we have z v v z v v and here 2 z v v so totally we have 4 z v v then we have z u v and here minus z u v any other u v so that is these two will get cancelled then we left with 2 times of z u v so we will write that here plus 2 times of z u v then this is v u and this is minus v u so this we can cancel then we have minus 2 v u so this will be minus 2 z v u so all the terms included which is equal to 0 and finally we can divide the entire equation by 2 so 2 z v v plus z u v minus z v u equal to 0 so whatever equation is given in the question they told us to transform it by changing the independent variable so after transforming the equation what we got is 2 z v v plus z v u sorry z u v minus z v u equal to 0